My name is John Nanyumba, Fort Bet Media Relations Manager. We are back in another week, a week where I want you guys to win money up to a full billion Uganda shillings on www.fortbet.ugon of our centers. The reason why I use the word must is because we have brought you a specialist when it comes to this field and this is none other than Vianney Junior Kasule from Spa FM. Vianney, you're welcome. Yeah, I'm glad to be here once again, John. Yes, Vianney has been here before and the last time he was here, he gave, he gave you some tips. Hope you won. He's again here to give you more tips. Without wasting time, we shall go straight into our first match, which is Man United hosting Burnley with a whole 86% of betters trusting it with a win and a 3 and a 2% respectively for uh, for draw and away wins. Vianney, where are we putting our money on this match? Mm, uh, the game is going to be interesting. Uh, Man United hosting team uh, Burnley. Uh, Man United at home at Old Trafford. Uh, first and foremost, Man United, their form has been coming back now. Uh, when you look at the last five games, uh, they are winning four, drawing one. Uh, that is good at their side. And they are hosting a team uh, which is somewhat stubborn. Uh, that is Burnley. Burnley, uh, under Shindais, uh, they have shown that uh, they are playing a defensive game. Uh, so you think of when even you look at the encounters, uh, their last encounters, 11 games mm. uh, in, all, in all competitions. Mm. Man United are winning uh, six games and mm. uh, Burnley winning one. Mm. And then they are drawing uh, four games. Uh, what does it show? It shows that Man United, they have an upper hand mm. with this game. Uh, but when you can look at the last three games, it has been so tough mm. uh, to Burnley uh, to win at Old Trafford. Uh, but even Man United, they are not forgetting uh, that was last year, yes. 2020, in January 2022, yes. mm. uh, when Burnley went to Old Trafford and won the game 2 0. Yes. Uh, so I think to be in heads of those Man United betters. Uh, but uh, again today, uh, if Man United they think of winning this trophy mm. uh, against Man City, uh, because Man City is topping the table uh, with 74 points and Man United in the second position uh, with 63 points, that's the difference of 11 points. Mm. But Man United mm. is down just one game. Um, Man City is having a game in hand at Man United, so they still have that hope. They will go to the last lot. I uh, think more that they can take over this trophy. Okay. Uh, great, great. So, uh, Give us where we're putting our money. Uh, yeah, Man yes. United can mm. win this game. Mm. Uh, first and foremost, they can win this game. Which it is odd, which is odd 1.36. Odd 1.36. Yes. Yes, but again, it can be a both teams to score. Uh, possibly. A both teams to score, which to is score. odd yes. 2.1. Yes. A yes. whole I take odd 2.1. Yes, I talk of a chance <laughs> Burnley to score in Man United. Yes. And Man United scoring at Burnley. But again, even win and over, it yes. is possible in that game. A win and over for Man United. Yes. A win and over of 2.5, that of means 2. three 5. goals and above. Yes. So a win and over 2.5 is also odd 2.2. Vienna is only giving you odd twos on Man United match. It's a very exciting one. It's also giving you, by the way, a way team to score, yes, which is odd 1.8. Very excellent odds. That's our first match. Our second match is Arsenal hosting Fulham. Both, both teams are struggling, but again, Fulham is struggling more than Arsenal is doing. Arsenal, with 85% of the betters trusting it with a win, and 5 and 2% respectively for X and the away win. Vianney, mm. yeah. Yeah, Arsenal, uh, they are going to be at home. That is Emirates Stadium. Uh, Fulham, last one a game at Emirates. That, in fact, uh, that was 2015 mm. in the Premier League. Yes. Uh, they have gone almost seven games in a row without losing, uh, without winning a game at Arsenal. Arsenal, their, last, uh, their first encounter, they won the game 3-0. Uh, the likes of Lakazanda, Lakazate, then we'll talk of Martinelli and other players uh, who helped Arsenal to win that game. Mm. Uh, Fulham and Scott Parker, they have been struggling. Uh, is one of the three teams I'm putting on paper uh, who will be relegated. Mm. Uh, that is Sheffield, Fulham, and possibly Timia, uh, that, uh, that is West Pro. Mm. Uh, but when you come to Arsenal, mm. uh, also their form has been on and off. Yes. But if they have that upper hand of winning at Fulham, I have looked at the last 10 games, yes. uh, Arsenal winning seven, and then they are drawing three games. Uh, but Arsenal has gone seven games in a row with mm. uh, Fulham, so and, and even winning uh, with consecutive goals like three to four goals. So I'll go with Arsenal uh, first to win the game, and then uh, secondly, Arsenal mm. winning again and uh, with a correct score of 3 0. 
Okay. We, winning the game with uh, a score of 3-0. Okay. It's possible. Yes. Okay, Vian first of all is giving you odd 1.77 Arsenal winning a straight win. Uh, you're also giving over of how many goals? Uh, three goals. Three goals and above. So over 2.5 which is odd 2. And lastly, he's very confident in giving you a correct score of 3-0. Yes. Which is odd 12. Which is a whole odd 12 from Vian Junior Kasule. Alright. Our last match is FA, which is Chelsea hosting um, Man Stay. Okay, this is FA Cup. And Chelsea winning has a 30% of the betters trusting it with the win, a 15 and a 55% for Man Stay. Okay, Viani is here to tell you where to place your money on this game. Is it 1, 2, or X? Yeah, 29 meetings between the two teams, Man City, Chelsea, uh, Man City winning 16 games, uh, Chelsea winning 9, and then they are drawing uh, 6 games to 4. Uh, it gives an upper to Man City to win this game. Mm -hmm. But myself, as Vianney, I will go with Chelsea. This is a final. John, you know what it means when it comes to a final. Yes. Uh, each team comes uh, thinking of winning a trophy. Yes. Uh, but when you look at the last game, uh, Man City meeting Chelsea, that was uh, in Premier League. Uh, Manchester won the game 31, but that was uh, just sort of under the management of uh, Frank James Rampart. Mm -hmm. Now they have a new coach, that is Thomas Tuchel. You think of Thomas Tuchel liking to win his first trophy mm -hmm. at Chelsea. This is his first final. Uh, so he will come consisting, knowing, uh, even putting pressure to his players, let's go and win this trophy. Mm -hmm. uh, so if you see even the form, uh, they have gone 18 games under the management of Thomas Tuchel. They have gone eight games, 18 games. Uh, just losing one, drawing three, even they are winning the rest of the game. So uh, it gives them a chance uh, to take over this game. I will go with Chelsea uh, to win this game. But if you can look at the last five games, yes. uh, it has been an over. <coughs> For those betting with fourth bet, mm. you can go with an over of 2.5. That is about three goals. Mm. You can go with both teams to score. If mm. you can look at the last four games between the two teams, they have been a both team score. Mm. So it gives an ch a, a chance to this game that will be a both teams to score. Mm. Then lastly, mm. uh, I will go with Chelsea winning this game with a correct score of 2-1. <laughs> a correct score of 2-1 to Chelsea. Okay, a straight, win, a straight win for Chelsea first of all is odd 4.8. Over 2.5 is odd 1.97. Both teams score yes is odd 1.88. And a correct score of 2-1. A correct score of 2-1 is a whole odd 14. This is why we are stopping this conversation because the odds are extra large. <laughs> All right, at this juncture, let us connect with our punters at the branch and they give you their predictions. All right, after Vian Junior Kasule giving his prediction, now we are with our punters at Nansana Main Branch. And this is the prediction for Man United vs Burnley. Manu is going to win that game with 2 1. Manu is winning with a correct score of 2 1. Sebo, what is your prediction on Arsenal vs Fulham? It's, a, it's a, a draw game. A draw game? Yes, Arsenal maybe one. Hey. And Fulham won. So, but you are very sure this is ending in a draw? It's in a draw game. Okay, and lastly, um, Chelsea is going to host Manchester State. This is FA Cup. What is your prediction on this match? Uh, I think, according to the statistics, yes. Manchester is overhead Chelsea. Yes. But Chelsea will win 2 1. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm going sure. This. Yes. Very sure in capital letter. Yes. Okay. Chelsea is winning this match, and the main odds for Chelsea winning are odd 4 plus. That's what this guy has given you. So those are predictions from our punters at Nansana Main Branch. My name is John Nanyumba, Fortbet Media Relations Manager. Fortbet. Play for billions now.